Story time with Sai. Don't let the pigeons stay up late. Words and pictures by Mo Willems. Oh, good! It's you. Listen, it's getting late, and I need to brush my teeth. Can you do me a favor? Don't let the pigeon stay up late. First of all, I'm not even tired. In fact, I'm in I'm in the mood for a hot dog party. What do you say? No? Hmm. I hear there's a good show about birds on TV tonight. Should be very educational. How about five more minutes? Come on, what's five minutes in the grand scheme of things? Yawn. What? What? I'm not. Get to talk anymore? Tell me about your day. Oh, I've got a great idea. We could count the stars. Can I have a glass of water? Studies show that pigeons hardly need any sleep at all. It's the middle of the day in China. I'll go to bed early tomorrow night instead. Hey, hey, ho, ho! This here pigeon just won't go. Please, my bunny wants to stay up too. You can't say no to a bunny, can you? Yawn. Okay, that was not a yawn. I was stretching. I'm yawn. One hundred and ten percent awake. You haven't heard the yawn last of me. Great work! Thanks. Good night. The end. What is your favorite part of the story? My favorite part of the story is where the pigeon finally fell asleep. The pigeon wants a puppy. I really do. Words and pictures by Mo Willems. To the pigeon, one puppy. Things I want. Oh, hello. How are you? I'm fine. Thanks for asking. By the way, do you know what I want? What I've wanted forever? At least since last Tuesday. Once a month. What? Everybody knows that that puppies need plenty of sunshine and water. Oh, I get it. You don't want me to be happy, do you? You don't want me to take a piggyback ride on my puppy or play 
had us with it? You just don't understand. I'm a puppy loving pigeon. Aww, puppy. I want a puppy right here and r right here, right now. Woof! What's that? Woof woof! Is it possible? Have my dreams come true? Woof! Ah! It's huge! The teeth, the hair, that wet nose, the slobber, the claws. I'm... I mentioned the teeth, right? Really, I had no idea. I've changed my mind. I want a walrus. To the pigeon, one walrus. The end. What is your favorite part of the story? My favorite part of this story is where the pigeon wants a walrus. A walrus is bigger than a puppy. Don't let the pigeon drive the bus. Words and pictures by Mo Willems. Hi, I'm the bus driver. Listen, I've got to leave for a little while. So can you watch things for me until I get back? Thanks. Oh, and remember, don't let the pigeon drive the bus. I thought he'd never leave. Hey, can I drive the bus? Please. I'll be careful. I'll tell you what, I'll just steer. My cousin Herb drives a bus almost every day. True story. Vroom, 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 vroom! Pigeon at the wheel! No? I never get to do anything. Hey! I've got an idea. Let's play drive the bus. I'll go first. Come on! Just once around the block? I'll be your best friend. How about I'll give you five bucks? No fair! I bet your mom would let me. What's the big deal? I I have dreams, you know. It's just a bus. Fine. Let me drive the bus. I'm back. You didn't let the pigeon drive the bus, didn't you? Great. Thanks a lot. Uh-oh. Bye. Hey. The end. What is your favorite part of the story? My favorite part of the story is where the pigeon wanted to drive a truck. Now, he not want to drive the bus anymore. <laughs>